Seer Byrne is an ambitious man, but he believes in the Abbey's mission, protecting the good people of the Empire against the likes of us. You know he'd be happier deep down if this ended with Brianna Ashworth's head on a spike. Maybe yours as well. You look great. Enrico said to give you his regards. That donkey-faced Cretan can open his wrists for all I care. Did you bring me something? The silver cigarette case, like we agreed? No, listen. I can't go on doing this. Stealing for you. I'll lose my job. Do you want to be a servant all your life? You're always talking about leaving Karnak on a big white boat, never to come back. You spend your days polishing silver cutlery. Come with me, Beatrix. Let's leave. Could we really get passage on a ship? What if they find us? You know I'll protect you. Just like when we were kids. I'll think about it. I promise. Dear Stomach, I have received your request and agree that dinner time cannot come quickly enough. Unfortunately, we are still on duty. I will get back to you if I...
must all know my voice right now. A new empress sits on the throne of Dundalk. Our rightful rulers are the Lilac Lord. First of her name. May she reign forever ever. There are some traitors. Quest, quest. They're claiming to the throne. Or orally. Conservatory. What do those walls hide? Yeah, the water gets nasty sometimes. It flows from the fountain to the conservatory basement. There was work there, but there's a great missing. Maybe some animal crawled in there and died. Disgusting. You'd think someone inside the conservatory would complain. The place is mostly shut, but somebody's still inside. There was a delivery from Jindosh Clockworks a few days back. Whatever they're doing, I'd be happier if the gate wasn't so close to that fountain.
hard this time. You Wouldn't up miss that. You bet. constant noise. At least they keep the curious away. Our mistress likes them where they are, so you'll have to tolerate them. Yes, but sometimes I want to smash them into a bloody pulp, just to enjoy the silence. Is this a riddle? We're talking about the Grand Guard, right? Not the lovely bloodflies. Of course, the bloodflies adore us. We should find more of the newly dead, so they can make new nests. Then I agree, but dear Brianna wants us to wait until after the communion. Until she's finished with the oracular sisters. We can't risk raising suspicion now. Then for now we'll wait, content with the nests we have. Ashworth's journal might tell me more about why Delilah can't be killed. After Delilah fell to the assassin Dowd, her magic was lost, and the coven scattered. I made a new life in Karnaka. Then I heard her whispering from the void, leading me to the Duke, who heard those same whispers. 
Together, we work to bring Delilah back into the world, changing the Empire from the home of Aramis Stilton three years ago. Across the Isles, all of us who'd been with her at Brigmore and before, we felt the magic return. Others joined. New faces, new blood. Now, Delilah is immortal. Forever. She holds Dunwall, and we've turned to corrupting the oracular order. The Overseers take guidance from their prophetic sisters, and soon we'll influence their dreams and visions. of slithering things in the hours before dawn. Former milkmaids and magistrates, come before me and bow, for I am Delilah, your queen. All hail Delilah, the moon in the sky and the mist lying over the lake like a blanket. Amelia, dear, if Brianna hears you and her mood is off, you're going to lose an eye making fun like that. She's only having fun, Francesca. And Brianna's too busy with the Communion to be bothered. She's got her mind on the Sisters of the Oracular Order. Yes, because otherwise the Abbey will see us all blackened by fire. Now stop with this nonsense. <laughs> She wanted to raise the blood briar, but cannot. <sighs> After trying to make gravehounds for weeks, she gave up. You should have seen the twisted things she made. All snouts and teeth and tails. That's just the way it is, dear Parmelia. Delilah wears the outsider's mark, and some of what she can do flows down to us. It doesn't seem fair. Think about working your fingers raw, weaving nets, or raising cows to slaughter. Any of the gifts we receive is better than living under the boot. That's true and fine. A wise way to look at things. But it won't help Lucinda rise any higher in Delilah's favor. Thank you. 
Rihanna was busy with something elaborate just before Delilah came to Karnaka. I wanted to know what it was. I'm teasing Tamina. I read it too. Do you think Delilah really could have done that? I've heard the same stories about Paolo the Howler. What you've heard about Paolo is not the same. He's a street orphan, full of tricks. But I have faith Delilah could do such a thing. Coming back? It doesn't seem possible. That's all. My dear Orlando, some people see doors where you and I only see walls. that way drove you mad and how glad you were to take it down. To Jindosh? I'm told he's a gibbering idiot now. I don't know, Delilah. Forgive me. No, my dear. It's a loss. But I doubt he had anything more to give us. Sokolov was taken away as well. Who would want that ancient fool? Never mind. How goes the communion? I am hungry to whisper into the ears of the oracular sisters. My influence grows. Last night, I walked through a dream with one of them, and we drank from a fountain in the town where she was born. Vice Overseer Burns' suspicions were right. won't affect things. No. He continued to take her with the lenses. Thicker, thinner, more opaque. It was time for to watch. I still have the old lenses and cast off parts piled in my workshop. But Jandash finished some time ago. The rest is up to me, learning to use the machine. The tricky thing, touching the void through such a device. Blood and biscuits. I look forward to using it myself once you're ready. Will you visit soon? Perhaps. Dunwall Tower is mostly in hand. The High Overseer won't be a problem anymore. And there's the matter of my own project. I grow more excited with each brushstroke. When I come to Karnaka, we'll drink an ocean of good wine and stay tight as a boiled owl. I look forward to it. For now, I need your eyes on the Duke. At least until we have the sisters under control. There's no one else I trust. I'll reach out to you again on the morrow. Farewell. Goodbye, Delilah, my Empress. Brianna to make an effigy of me. You mean like this tangle of skin and bones representing one of the Dunderheads from the Oracular Order? Yes. I'd keep it in my chambers. You have bizarre taste, my dear Clarissa. Um, I wouldn't want to see myself like that. Six, I'd rather have my portrait three. painted by Delilah. There's a quality to Brianna's style I prefer. 
touched by something from deep down in the mud where there's no light. The endless womb and the cold, dead grave. Both the same. But Brianna's effigy has let her reach into the mind, into the heart. Wouldn't you be afraid she'd influence your dreams? Like she's going to do to the Sisters of the Abbey? That's part of the thrill, sister. Bryce, that's the part I want. <laughs> Jindosh was insane. How does this even work? sabotage Ashworth's communion device, she'll be powerless. Who is this man Karen Jindosh? And what power does he hold over Brianna? Are they lovers? Perhaps, but that wouldn't give him any power over Brianna. Jindosh is an ally, an agent of the Duke, gifted in the ways of natural philosophy. Together, they've built something that can pierce the void itself. I've never seen Brianna work with machines. She's always relied on precious bones and ivory, carved in a room with no light, painted with ash and moon's blood. Not lenses and silver cogs covered in stinking grease. This is a special endeavor important to Delilah. You think no one can harm us, but the Overseers and the Sisters of the Oracular Order are fanatics dedicated to stopping us from living the lives we want. So why use their own machinery? These music boxes, even when torn apart, they'll bring us bad luck. I don't like it. Jindosh and Brianna know what they're doing. Their collaboration is unusual, but it pleases Delilah, and it's Brianna's obsession. So it is then. Let's hope that cursed mechanism doesn't pull us all into the void. 